hello guys welcome to this course of es6 in this video i'll show you how we can use the javascript string includes method to check if the string contains another string here is the basic syntax of the include method of javascript the include method determine whether a string contain another string it will return true if the source source a string found in the string otherwise it will return the false the position is an optional parameter that specifies the position within the string at which to begin the sourcing for the source string the, the default position if it's not provided is zero the include method is also case sensitive so let us take an example let email equals to admin at the rate example.com console.log email dot includes As you can see, when it sorts at the rate in the email string, it returns true. Let's look into another example. Here is our string. When you look console.log, str.includes. When you try to find the string within our str variable, we can see that it returned true. If we change the s from uppercase to lowercase, the the return value is false as we know that include matches the string case sensitively only. So. For example, if we try to find the script within this string, then it returns true. If we provide the position that is file, it tells that we need to begin the sourcing from the fifth position. So the S, so the script will be sources after the fifth position beginning from the fifth position with which written false value if we change the length position from which the source to begin to four the value that written will be true so in this tutorial we have learned how to use the javascript string includes method to determine whether a string contains within another string Thank you for watching guys, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel.